Good afternoon, everyone. I am so excited about this initiative today. I couldn't be more excited about kicking off the Mayor's Book Club. As Ramiro mentioned, reading has been such an important part of my life, and I, I it's just such a treat to me to disappear into a novel or a, uh, any good book. It was certainly an important part of my education. My love of reading served me well throughout my foundation years in school as well as throughout college and graduate school and carrying into my professional life. And our city really needs to encourage a culture of reading in order to counteract our unacceptably high levels of illiteracy and to help prepare all San Antonians for a productive future. Almost anyone can learn to read. We have examples of success right here in San Antonio, but some estimates still put us at 60th in the nation in, re in terms of adult functional literacy. And so that's really not acceptable because we can't prepare our residents for jobs of the future. They can't read a job application. So when it came time to create the Mayor's Book Club, I didn't pick a book about San Antonio or even a book set in Texas. And now it's time for the big reveal so you can see what book I did choose. Rebecca, please do the honors. Ta-da! I chose Rocket Boys. Rocket Boys. The memoir of a NASA engineer who grew up in a coal mining town in Appalachia. And Rocket Boys is about one boy and his love for science, his struggles with his father, his childhood friendships, but it's also a book about universal themes, authority and independence, the dream of progress, love of learning, and how far education can carry us. It's also a beautiful portrait of a community by outward standards of poor community that is rich in human relationships, caring, and potential. This memoir is a strong reminder, or perhaps for many readers, an introduction to the idea that people of diverse ethnicities, faiths, and socioeconomic status have much more in common than that which separates us. And so when we read about this small West Virginia town in the 1950s, we come to know those people, and we also come to realize certain truths about ourselves. That is the true gift of reading, and I truly hope that all of you will enjoy a journey of discovery through Rocket Boys. So everyone, please get a copy, and as I mentioned, I haven't had as much time to read as I would love to, so I've gotten through about two chapters so far, uh, and I am looking forward to carving out some time on some weekends coming up to get through the rest of the book and I can't wait to talk to people about the book so we will be hosting some gatherings so that we can all talk about what we learned and uh, what we enjoyed about reading the book as well so but thank you to everyone that helped to make this um, possible and I'm so looking forward to all of San Antonio getting together and reading this book and then other books to come so that we can continue to promote literacy and just lifelong learning because in today's culture and economy we can't just rest on our laurels just because you got a degree or you achieved a certain status we all have to keep learning so that we can continue to be uh, productive and beyond that it's just there's so much joy in it so I hope that you all enjoy our first book Rocket Boys thank you